Hi, Michelle Leighton here. In this video, we're going to be looking at the Weaver 2 theme. As I explained and showed examples previously, I've used the Weaver theme for many of my sites and also my clients' sites. This is because it's a stable theme, recommended by WordPress themselves. They now have updated the theme and Weaver 2 is available. We will be testing this together, as I have not used it yet. But the appeal for me is the mobile friendly aspect of it. The theme displays much more favourably on a mobile phone. This is so important for a local business when they have potential customers searching when they are out and about. So we're going to come to our site wp-admin type in our username and our password and we're going to go to our appearance and we're going to install themes then we're going to search for Weaver 2 that's a capital I twice and here's the Weaver 2 we want to install Weaver 2 install now and activate and let's have a look at our site so there's our new site with the Weaver 2 theme installed now if we come back to the dashboard if we come down to appearance we can see that we've got Weaver 2 admin we click on that. Here you can see some sub themes that we can select. At the moment, the one that we're using is the default antique ivory. So if you have a look down, see which ones that you like. I quite like the shadows, it's nice and simple and clean. So I'm going to choose for now shadows, but you have a look through see which ones suit you. So choose shadows and set to selected sub theme. And then if we come up to my blog, there we can see our new theme. Coming back to the dashboard, there's lots of other settings inside here. We won't go into them all now. And also if we come to appearance and come down to header we can see, see here there's also a few predefined headers we can choose from also so we'll look at changing the header in a, in a future video um, but for now I'm just going to choose the sky save the changes visit our site, see how it looks, there we go, 